from Josiah Siegel. Unexpectedly, he went six and a third. So he saves the bullpen. He allows Zach Maxwell to pitch for the first time now in this regional. Keys Grissom Jr. But Danny Hall's group got the job done. Tres Gonzalez serves one in the left, and what a run and catch by Seth Stevenson. What a way. The staff is young. I mean, there's some veteran players in this line. Cortland Lawson drives this one to center field, and it drops down in front of Colin Hall. Big turnaround first. And Lawson will retreat with a leadoff single in that weekend rotation. Seth Stevenson rolls one to third. Captain snares it, and they get the force. On uh, Cortland Lawson. Opportunities to offenses like these two. Runner goes. Kevin Parada's throw. Not in time to get Seth Stevenson. Out of the hand. Fastball strikes out back, mm. and it's a hundred from Zach Maxwell. His first year in 2002, and then in 2006, as his son Colin works a walk here. Julio Bourbon starting their careers. Chase Headley, an All American. Jackson floats this one a right center field into the gap and drops it down. Close play at second. And Jackson is safe. He doubles out of the nine spot, and Georgia Tech's got him at second and third. With two aboard, two out, two two. On the ground, left side, and Lawson. He collects. Low throw. Gets by Lipsius. Two run score, and Georgia Tech takes the lead. Beam sets. Two two. Strike three called. With a fastball on the black to lead Parada. I think that's a big factor, too. I mean, we got some 24, 25-year-old players in the college game that you don't typically see as you get a base hit. 3-1 no. pitch from Beam. is driven in the air. Left center field. Gilbert goes back to the wall. Right on cue, it's a two-run shot for Stephen Reed. And it's a four-run Georgia Tech lead. Well, Stephen Reed got to count his favor. 3-2, inside of all four. Back-to-back -back walks. On the ground, right side. Jenkins can't field it. It's in the right. Russell scores, and Tennessee is on the board. Boy, the ball was not hit hard. Andrew Jenkins over at first base for Georgia Tech just kind of pounded right into the turf. A little short hop right there, and it comes up on Jenkins. Once it came up on Jenkins and gets by, Russell scores. Pick. Hits it on the ground. Diving staff captain, and he throws out Beck. Lawson scores. It's a two-run game, but what a play by Drew Captain. And slam against Wright State. First pitch on the ground right side at Simpson, who throws out Gilbert. 70 RBIs. Hits this one hard in the left field, a base hit. Proving your point, one out rocket to left. You can just tell when some guys step in the box, you can see the confidence. It's just bouncing off of them. One, two. Gonzalez sweeps it in the air to shallow right, and it drops down. Jenkins to second. Back to back singles with one out in the fifth. Reed hits it hard on the ground to short, kicks away from Lawson. Runner to the plate. Ortega's throw and a half. Got him. Standing depth of this slider. Gets a bouncing ball from Ortega past the dive of Captain into left field. Second hit for Jarrell Ortega, who just did it defensively.
And now we'll get the tying run to the plate. Man at second, 3-2, is low ball four. Tying run aboard here in the sixth inning. 3-2, low ball four. They are loaded. On a one-two. Strike three count. Mad Max gets it done. Going to be fun to watch this weekend. And isn't that the truth? And now Will Mabry buzzes right through the sixth. Better in there, too. Luke Lipsia slaps it the other way. Base hit into the left field corner. Lipsius leads off the seventh with a double. Six. Bouncing ball left side. High chopper got a hurry. Jackson gets rid of it. Not in time. Tying run aboard for Tennessee. 3 0. Gilbert swings. Bounces it high to first. Jenkins gloves. Flips. In time. Tony Vitello sprints out of the dugout, and that indicates a certain review. Oh, oh. <laughs> so hard to tell, and it's it hard to tell. Not get closer. It's hard to tell. And again, it just feels like one of those ones. It's a 50. In what feels like the last 24 hours. Out at first. They say the call stands. Man. Gilbert can't believe it. Off the end of the bat. Right field. Falling fast and it drops down. Lipsia scores. They stop back. And it's a one-run ball game. Yeah, Jordan Beck just can't score on that from second base because you don't know if the ball is going to be called or not. So you got to kind of get halfway. There's Jordan Beck right there, center. His spot of his career. First pitch. Terrell Ortega on the ground is short. Jackson flips. Simpson turns. Picked by Jenkins. Wow. Seven tomorrow, and that would be at 1 o'clock Eastern. Chandler Simpson rolls it to short. Cortland Lawson, his throw pulls Lipsius off the bag, and the speedy Simpson is on. And now Kevin Parada, first pitch swinging, base hit left field. He had been 0 for 3, and Kevin Parada, author of one of the greatest seasons in Georgia Tech history, Bouncing ball, left side. Mabry gloves, pivots, throws out Jenkins. Do your PFPs, kids. One away. Simpson dancing off a third. First pitch swinging in the air to center. Drew Gilbert's under it, and Mabry escapes. Work it down in a way like Luke Lucius did, right? You work the ball to the opposite field. Four pitches, and Burke is aboard. 2-2 two -two pitch. Russell hits it on the ground towards short. Simpson's turn. Two again. In the air. Center field, but right at Hall. Inning over. Maxwell tonight. Reed hits it. Over loss in left field base hit. Leadoff man on to start the bottom of the eighth inning. And now Drew Captain, the switch hitter. Check swing roller to second. Ortega did not get the tag. One out. Reed to second. And now left on left with Colin Hall. He bounces one right back at Ortega. Two away. Reed to third. Two outs to face Jaden Jackson. First pitch swinging. Another roller at Ortega. Inning over. Shirt freshman Dickey, who hits it on the ground. Up the middle. Tying run aboard. The 
plate working that way. Bouncing ball up the middle. Simpson gloves, flips, in time. For a four-side Booker that if it stands or is confirmed, will be out number one. Well, I can't tell there. I cannot tell there. <laughs> now, in that view, in that view, safe at second. Ball double play for the third inning in a row. Line to center. Over the head of Hall. All the way to the wall. Booker scores. We're tied. Jordan Beck. I mean, he barrels this ball up and hits a rock, and this fools the center fielder Hall. Hall didn't realize how hard this ball was hit. He goes up the ladder. Chandler Simpson can't believe it, and you don't think Jordan Beck is fired up? Infield in. Upstairs, and it hits him. Tennessee leads. Question is, how big a lead? On the ground, diving step, copped into the plate for the first out. On a hot shot by Jarrell Ortega, and another dandy of a play by Compton. On the ground, left side, base hit. Gilbert scores. Lips come right behind him. Moore delivers again. I mean, just think about the moves Tony Vitalo has made in this inning, right? Evan Russell, left field base hit. Ortega scores. Four-run lead. Gonzalez, his throw gets away. And extra base, second and third. This is mayhem. Two two in the air, left field. Gonzalez runs it down and deep enough to add on. Cut on and missed. Hill strikes out Booker. Inning over. Simpson is up. On the ground, left side, base hit. Two aboard for the Jackets. Wall steals. Left side on a hop. Lawson will go to first. Not in time. Base is loaded. Second team all conference. Hits this one well in the center field. Base hit. Simpson scores. Parada to the plate. Three-run game in the ninth. Three-two again. Is low, and the tying run is aboard. Winning run to the plate. Payoff pitch. Start three calls. Tennessee is headed to the Supers.